here's what I've noticed recently in the explosion of Indigenous literature. Often when it comes to writing, there's the setup, the denouement, and the payoff. There's a, there's a typical structure. What I'm finding in Indigenous literature is the greatest celebration now that we see is the reclaiming of language, culture, traditions, customs, names, songs, dances. This is really a time of reclaiming. And so I would invite every teacher when, when they're reading a text is to ask themselves, what is this Indigenous author bringing to their book for the very first time? Because this is a time where like, I was the first Clicho Dene to ever be published as a novelist 20 years ago. I'm still the only one. What I'm noticing is that there are these new voices that are emerging from different territories and from different traditions where they're finally able to share their perspective on the world and the celebration of walking in two worlds. So, so teachers, please just think about what is being reclaimed here? How is it being presented? Because every Indigenous publication is a celebration. I think in order to get the most out of text in the Indigenous text or literacy is to always have it visible, making sure that it's in your classrooms. Uh, your literacy, your library should be a reflection of the students in your class or the students that you're trying to reach. Um, another thing is just creating that exposure. So always ensuring that your library is diverse and it includes the Indigenous voice and Indigenous history and perspective. I think a good way um, when teachers are being purposeful with choosing text and getting the most out of it is to consider what are their children seeing? What are they seeing about themselves? What are they seeing about their peers? What is the story telling? How are you framing thought? How are you framing story? And when we tell a new story with our children in our classrooms, when we tell a new story, uh, when they go home and read literature with their parents in the evening, we tell a new story throughout Alberta and throughout Canada and Turtle Island. And so it's really about um, shaping consciousness it's really about restoring Alberta. How do we restory together as curriculum uh, co-creators?